you think about true success in life, it's going to come down to relationships. And Paul has a statement, 1 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 8, we love you so much we share the gospel with you, but not only the gospel, our lives as well. What does it mean to share your life with somebody? Do you feel like you are sharing your life with a lot of people? And uh, two things to think about. One, time. Paul was busy, all kinds of things to do, but he took time with the Thessalonians, and it was personal, it was up close, visit, getting quality time together. And the second one, sharing your heart. He set an example for them. He really let them, you know, intimacy, seeing into somebody. Intimacy is something he welcomed, transparency, and he let them, you know, ask questions, check out how he lived. He opened up his heart. So who are you spending the most time with? And who are you really opening up your heart with? And that's where the connection happens. And you really can't substitute those things. That's success in life, because healthy relationships, that's at the center of success. So think through what adjustments you might make in either opening your heart or spending more time. Think about the people around you and ask God who he really wants you to open your heart with and share that time. Sharing our lives, there's no substitute for it. It's how God has made us and the connecting is so rich when we do those two things.